Welcome to a new video on Quiver. What? Yeah, let's equip that one right away. Box Squasher! Uh, yeah, Quiver. I've, I haven't played it in a while. And, um... It released in full today. So... Let's try it out and see what's new. Wanna, wanna, yeah, I think I wanna drink the tutorial. To the Aldurian sub From here, you will travel to battlefields near and far, charged with repelling the encroaching dark. So, draw your first arrow from the quiver on your back, and we'll be good. Now, loose an arrow into this target. The next target is different. It will teleport you. Well done. The panel on your bow hand provides infoglow. If you attack these targets, numbers will appear to indicate how much damage you've dealt. You can enable this feature in combat as well, using the settings menu. To deal more damage with an arrow, draw it back and hold it before releasing. This is called an aim shot. Well struck. While the bow and arrow are your primary weapons, Magical abilities await your command as well. One such power is your orb ability, which can be summoned in your free hand. Now throw the orb to damage the target. Well done. These are merely the basics. There is always more to learn and discover. I don't know. Are, however, ready to join the fight. When called upon to battle, you must push the enemy back and seal the game. Blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. You will be rewarded greatly for your success. New bonds, <laughs> armor, and power await you. Now go, and may you find victory. Okay, so let's just try multiplayer because that's where the meat of the game is. Hello, folks. Oh, that's interesting. Yo, hello, please can join. So, headshots. Basically, I mean, for, for, for those I don't know it. It's it's a wave-based defense game, and I think a pretty nifty one. And um, yeah, you have to advance, close gates, or oh yes, exploding arrow. I think yeah, that's it. that's our main mission right now. It's closing the gate. And uh, yeah, if if you do critical hit, which is a headshot, it's when when the red uh, crosshair appears on your target, oopsie daisy. Ah, too short. Ah, come on. Okay. Okay, guys, we're almost done with this level. We've got probably only five more to go. Mm, come on. Okay. Come on, tracking. Behave. And yeah, it's pretty exhausting. And yeah, that beam heals my own game. Ooh. Okay, something happened. The ball was full. Okay, let's go up ahead. Okay. 
Okay, that was bad. That was better. And the enemies behave differently, and I'm not, not going to talk about too much about them. And yeah, I, I think the archery mechanics are pretty cool. It's, it's a nice way to, to relax a bit. And it has a, a pretty cool loot system where you can upgrade your gear with the random drops. But to be honest, I, I actually don't know all the features that are new. I haven't haven't even read the release notes. Just saw it dropped in 1.00. I guess we got a spectator here. Yeah, I should have. I actually don't know what my old is. Let's slow them down. These are some elite enemies. It does make you feel like Legolas. It might not not be as popular as uh, Elven Assassin, but I haven't actually played that one. Let's see. Those fuckers are the most dangerous ones, at least they were in early, early, in early versions. <laughs> oh, never saw those elite ones holding two. I like the teleporting, how teleporting solve this game. Close that gate. So that works differently than it did before. Before you had to get on those posts and it will slowly close. I guess that changed a bit. You just have to kill enemies. Oh, that's a new enemy. Let's see that one. It did it grow darker? Oh, 
Thank you. Come on. Might retreat a bit. Always pays off to be friendly. Come on, tracking. Do behave. Uh, nobody's behind. Okay. I guess they're doing good up front. I. I sworn might have. Signify a new wave. I think that we can all shoot up to the front. You guys can all shoot up to the front. I'm, I'm shooting them all. I guess after this level's over, see the teleport. I, I don't know. This might be the procedurally generated mode. I have no clue, to be honest. <laughs> Which is always good for a YouTube video, or you want to show off a game having no clue. Yeah, that's what people want. Because clue is overrated. is pretty impressive. Hmm, that's a new boss. It's a penis. Oh, that wasn't good. I'm dead now. Oh no. Got better. Oh, my be. I would have thought that shooting glow bits always helps. Oh, fuck. Okay, Mr. Penis Worm. Oh, come on. That's a bit. You need to look all around you, which I suppose is nice. Okay, guess it's over there. Come on. Where, where's the glowy bits? Where's my controller? Uh, 
There's a little bit. And I got eaten by worm. But there's not much consequence to it. Guess we need to shoot the other glow bit on the other side. Oh no! That was well timed. Oh, our gate's about to give out. I think it's time for me to move. <laughs> now that was a long tail. This is where it appears. So I guess now that it's going to be a glow a bit again. Okay, out of here. Whoa. Ah, fuck, too slow. I... Oh! Enemy repelled! <sighs> oh, even got two wards. And... I want something. But it's too mockers to be... Blue leather gloves! I have no clue how. Stop, stop hopping around. Yeah, let's equip them. They're blue. Blue's always nice. And, uh... Yeah. I think that's... I mean, you got, you got the main loop, like, shoot enemies, defend gates, close gates, and then you have a boss fight, which are more involved now than they were before. Before they were just big bullet sponges, so that's nice. And um, on that, uh, I think we'll call it a day. So, see you, and good night.